Hello, my awesome Taurus. I missed you guys. Taurus, I hope you're having a great weekend. Taurus, you want a soulmate reading to check up on the latest energies between you and your soulmate. First, we're going to ask what's coming up for you, Taurus, what you'll be dealing with facing in your life and how you're currently doing on your soulmate journey. Second part of this video, we're going to ask about your soulmate, whoever it is you're thinking of concentrating on while watching this video, whether you're currently in contact with them or not. First, we're going to ask how this person is doing at this time and how they are currently relating to you emotionally, what's on their mind, what they thinking, feeling at this time, especially in relation to you, Taurus. Universe, please step in, show very clear and important messages for the sign of Taurus, for Taurus, highest good, please. Oh, this one wants to show up as extra message. Universe, please show us what's coming up for Taurus in their life, and how is Taurus currently doing on their soulmate journey? What's coming up for Taurus in their life? And how is Taurus currently doing on their soulmate journey? Mm. Yeah, so there will be, yeah, there will be um, some kind of um, disagreement between different people and people will try to somehow uh, involve you in that disagreement uh, where you feel you're going to have to like stand up for yourself or defend your name you see whether it's at work or neighborhood wherever there's going to be some people if it hasn't already happened it's about to happen where people will try to involve you in that uh, disagreement or altercation and you you're going to have to defend yourself or explain yourself or stand up for yourself because here you are holding a sword. Yeah. Ooh, somebody's gonna be on your side though. Somebody powerful, strong. It could be at work even, could be anywhere. But uh, somebody is gonna have your back. Yeah. Somebody is gonna speak up on your behalf. You won't even be aware of it. Somebody's gonna defend you, most likely a female. Yeah, you see, you're going to have to defend yourself still. Yeah, you see, you're going to have to stand up for yourself. Somebody is going to try to drag you into their drama, circle of drama, but you, you're going to respond accordingly. Universe, please show us. It's like a heated battle argument because all these ones are showing up here. Look at this. Five of Wands, Page of Wands, Seven of Wands, Queen of Wands. But this Queen of Wands is on your side, though. Mm -hmm. You must please show us. Yeah, this is good. I like this. You must please show us what's coming up for Taurus in their life. And how is Taurus currently doing on their summit journey? Yeah, you see, more Wands. My goodness. Yeah, Ten of Swords. Look at this. So you already were... Uh, kind of talked about between these people. These people have been talking, involving you indirectly into this. Yeah. Yeah, you see? Be careful because some of those people are not authentic with you. Here you see snakes and some are authentic like this person here. Yeah, you're going to see people's true colors. Yeah, you're going to see who is authentic, who is not. Yeah, you are showing here, you are showing up here as single not in a relationship right now very attractive very independent strong willed good at your job business you know please show us you stand up for yourself yeah you have healthy boundaries yeah you do this is good people are intimidated by your inner strength your independence yeah you see look at this um, this is you feeling a great need to detach yourself from uh, people who are chaotic, who bring chaos to you. Yeah, you want to be in solitude. You really want to retreat away from people. It shows it clearly, like you feel you need a break from people. Yeah, you, you want to retreat, be around animals, nature. Yeah, you are exhausted. Be careful what you wish for, you're going to get it. Beautiful. You have so much power within you to manifest what's important to you in your life. Yeah. Yeah. You have power within you. Yes. Beautiful. You're going to uh, balance some kind of karma with this 
uh, energy, chaotic energy that is showing up here. Like you're going to um, uh, make even more healthy boundaries for people to respect. You're going to see very clearly who does not belong in your life and who does. And this person, I like this person, whoever this person is, this person's true to you. And you may not even be aware fully because your back is turned towards them. Like you may be not aware that this person is standing up for you and speaking good on your behalf. Yeah. Yeah, I see. This is you protecting yourself from this drama that showed up. Universe, please show us what's coming up for Taurus in their life. And how is Taurus currently doing on their summit journey? Yeah, I see. Look at this hot mess over here. Seven of Wands, Seven of Wands twice from two different tarot decks. Yeah, this is you feeling a great need to defend your good name, to stand up for yourself. Yeah, you are very powerful. Yeah, I see again, my goodness, again, Five of Wands. We just saw this, you see, with the bigger tarot deck. So we have Five of Wands twice and Seven of Wands twice. You're going to... It looks like most of you already went through this, but this is a residual energy still going on that's still going to affect you more. Um, yeah, where you have to watch out for certain people. Yeah, you see? Wow, you view your soulmate as not reciprocal in this connection with you. You are single, available. You You feel like this person is not meeting you halfway, like you had to walk away from this relationship. They didn't offer commitment, didn't express emotions, they didn't listen to your concerns. However, new soulmate is popping up here as king of wands. Beautiful. I love kings and queens. Kings and queens can offer a relationship that's healthy. King of wands. Beautiful. So, um, new soulmate popping up for you. Let me see what's going on with the soulmate of yours that you're thinking of. The one that just showed up as a knight. Knight of Wands, and then let's see what else shows up. In the extended reading, we're going to ask about the Knight of Wands person and King of Wands, the new soulmate. The universe, please show us what's going on currently with the soulmate of Taurus, the one that showed up as Knight of Wands, and how is the soulmate of Taurus towards Taurus at this time? What's going on currently? with the soulmate of Taurus. And how is the soulmate of Taurus towards Taurus at this time? Wow, this person is missing you. Yeah, they feel very connected with you, past life connection between you two. Very connected. This person loves you. Yeah, you see? So they're not interested in anybody else this person wants to come towards you with some kind of offer yeah they want to so badly communicate with you this is in the subconscious position this person is hoping that this communication will happen between you two it was please show us what's going on these are positive uh cards here universe please show us what's going on currently with the soulmate of taurus and how is the soulmate of taurus towards taurus at this time Wow, the sun, my two favorite cards, the sun and the star together, very unusual. Um, this person realizes how important you are to them, how much they care for you. This is the best card in the whole deck, the sun. They're very guarded. They want to break silence. They want to communicate something to you of great importance. They, Yeah, this person feels deep regret, sadness, heartbreak. They're not able to move on with their life. They regret losing you. Yeah. See, they want to fix whatever was done wrong. You see, this is them wanting to correct things, to, to make things better. Wow, reconciliation. This person is hoping that by some miracle, reconciliation will happen between you two. Yeah, you see, they want to take action, but they're scared. They want to take action towards you, but they're so scared how you're going to react. Yeah, so you walked away. They see you as walking away uh, from this connection, like you left this connection. That's how they feel. Wow, you think um, their silence means they don't care? No, this person is deeply distraught emotionally over losing you. Look at all these swords in their back. They feel 
they feel what you've been feeling in this connection. Yeah, what you've been feeling, they are feeling now. You see, they're feeling this sadness, regret, heartbreak. This is heavy. Look at all these swords. My goodness. Ten of swords, nine of swords, two of swords. Justice with ace of swords. This is them realizing how deeply affected they are emotionally by this disconnection. Let me see what's going on with this eight of wands, which represents back and forth communication, also travel. In which we show us what's going on currently with the soulmate of Taurus. And how is the soulmate of Taurus towards Taurus at this time? Wow, this is how they view you. Marriage material. Attractive. Independent. Strong-willed. Yeah, they're very scared of showing how emotionally vulnerable they are in this connection with you. How much they miss you. How heartbroken they feel. They're guarding their heart very closely. You see, they are at a crossroads. They know they're going to have to do something, even though they have a lot of fear. They know that they need to see things through, that they need to have to do something. You see, the sun is present, which is a good sign for clarity. You see, eight of wands. This person is hoping that there's going to be communication. And if they communicate with you, they're hoping you're not going to reject them. This person is trying to figure out, do they wait for you or do they reach out to you first? Um, this person doesn't want to be swayed by their emotions. They want to have clarity. They want to figure out what it is you're feeling. Is, does it match what they're feeling? They're trying to figure you out. They want to figure out your current state of mind. Um, hmm. We're going to go into your extended reading, Taurus, and we're going to ask about two soulmates, the one that wants to come back to you for communication that showed up as Knight of Wands and the new one that showed up as King of Wands. So first we're going to ask about this soulmate's true, genuine, long-term intentions and plans for you at this time. What are they planning long-term? Then we're going to ask what they currently hiding from you, what they have up their sleeve, whether they're hiding it on purpose or can communicate for whatever reason, but the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good. And of course, at the end, we're going to ask advice for you on how to best handle this soulmate connection at this time and anything else you need to know about your life, including new soulmate entering your life, which showed up as king of wands, new chapters, new beginnings in your life. Also, your health, finances, business, job opportunities, family matters, friendships, whatever this you need to know, they'll show it at the end of the reading as well. Wow. So Taurus, click on the extended link below this video in the description box below, and I'll see you there. Love you guys.